Hey guys, it's Archers here and welcome back to a brand new video. So it's been a little while. It's been, I think, a couple weeks, if not more. And recently, just recently, I think it was yesterday, we had the release of the Hogwarts Legacy official cinematic trailer. So I can't wait to see this. I already know kind of what's in the game because I've seen like the gameplay showcases and seen other reveals. So I pretty much know what's coming, but it's going to be interesting to see what they've done in this uh, cinematic trailer. So yeah, I'll stop waffling and let's just get straight into watching it. All right, here we go. So this is the Hogwarts Legacy official cinematic trailer. Let's go. He's like, what have you just attached to my leg? What was that? <laughs> oh. Okay, this is cool. This kind of reminds me of... You know, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to speak afterwards. So I'll, I won't pause it too much. Oh, nearly headless Nick. This is, okay, I can already tell. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I said I, was, I wasn't going to pause it, but I paused it now. But I can already tell, like, internally, I am just really gassed. This is going to be an amazing game. I can't wait. But, like, just seeing, because these are obviously places we can go to, right? Different locations, like the Forbidden Forest and stuff. So just seeing the amount of area we have to roam is, yeah, that's crazy in itself. Oh. Oh, right. So this is like a, I don't know. Well, they're not Death Eaters, so I don't know what they are. Oh, nice. That was well done. Your legacy is written now. So that was the letter. That was the letter for us. Jeez. So that trailer was pretty much, here you go. Here's your, so I've got the Hogwarts letter now. That's sick. I've always wanted to have that. Obviously, I don't have it in person, but I mean, this is the best I'm going to get. So this is, okay that, okay. that trailer was just us getting the Hogwarts letter. Okay, <laughs> I don't know what to think. So as you can tell, I was a little bit all over the place and I've got a little bit of a stuffy nose, so hence why I sound a bit weird. But that trailer was everything and more because it just showed us everything we needed to know without kind of overextending on the story, if that makes sense. Like clearly there was that, we saw who the like the, potential villains are the, the people with the hippogriff who had it chained up and stuff and i know there's going to be trolls and stuff as well. not tro yeah trolls and dwarves and stuff i'm pretty sure dwarves are the main enemy unless there's going to be like another uh, not secretive but like a plot twist type enemy i don't know but yeah we saw us we saw natsayonai at some point during the trailer as well i noticed that we also saw i think did we see sebastian Stallo? i'm not sure i don't think we did you know what i, I can play through it why, why am i not playing through it again okay let me have a look i don't know who that is this is where we saw, yeah. Oh, we saw nearly headless Nick. There we go. Here he is. Oh, there he is. Almost got his head knocked off. And some of the combat in this game looks really cool. Like, and obviously this is the cinematic trailer, so it's not going to be exactly the same. But the gameplay doesn't look too far off. It's actually really, really good. The one thing I didn't like about the gameplay was when you're casting spells. I don't like the fact that you can see the the hit marker, like the amount of like health you've taken of the um the enemy. I mean, um, there may be a way to turn that off. I'm not sure. Maybe in the settings, but yeah, I don't know. It kind of takes away from that whole immersion of you casting a spell because then at that point you're just it's kind of just like you're chipping away damage at someone and it doesn't really feel like you're actually casting a spell. But yeah, other than that, that's your only criticism I've, I've, I've had for. I've, uh, I can't speak. That's the only criticism I've had for this game so far. Other than that, it looks amazing. In fact, it looks too good to be true. That's what I'm worried about. That it comes out like this amazing game, and then it just turns out to be kind of like a try-hard game. Don't want to say cyberpunk, but it kind of was. Cyberpunk wasn't the greatest, but still. You know, I've seen like the you know the gameplay showcase, and I've seen the developers there and stuff, and presenting the game, and they do seem that they're, they're really passionate about it. So it does seem like they've really put some like heart and soul into this game. So I'm confident that it's not going to come out like a like a little of a, a little bit of a mess. But I guess. We'll just have to wait and see. There may be some stuff to break down in here, which I'll be doing later on. Immediately looking, there's nothing new, I don't think, that I've noticed. There may be. I'll have to have another look. But for now, I don't see anything new. Something that I'm like, oh my god, I didn't expect that. Because we've seen a lot from gameplay trailers, gameplay showcases and stuff. So, but yeah, that's just my thoughts on it. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. I am really hyped for this game. I'm sure you guys are as well. I am going to be playing it on, well, I think it's coming out on the 10th. But if you get pre-order, it comes out on the 7th. So I'll definitely be playing it on the 7th. I actually was bought it for the PS4 and I had to cancel the pre-order for that because the PS4 and the xbox one i think are coming out in april whereas the X xbox series x and s 
are coming out in February. Same with the PS5. If it was any other game, I probably would have, but I really didn't want to wait that long for, for Hogwarts Legacy. I wanted to play it as soon as it came out. If it was any other game, maybe God of War, I would have done the same, but any other game, probably not. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, let me know what you think down in the comments below of this game, and I'm sure you're excited for it. That'll be it from me. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I shall see you all later.